Welcome back to Taronga TV, folks. My name's Hayden. This is Troy. Welcome, mate. Thanks, Great mate. to have you Thanks, here. Andy. Troy is one of the water techs. We have an amazing water tech team. Now, what is a water tech? A water technician looks after the immense amount of salt and fresh water that we have here at Taronga. We've got Daryl, we've got Tommy, we've got Sergey, and we've got Troy. And Troy's going to take us on a bit of a guided tour today. But you might wonder why we're standing up here. Many of you have been to Taronga, have stood right here in Seal Theatre, where we deliver this amazing Seals for the Wild presentation, teach you all about marine stewardship council from our keepers and our beautiful seals in our care but what's underneath this troy not a lot of people know about no do they? no one knows about it can you please share us with us what's under there yeah there's plant rooms that look after all the water in gso so we've got about three and a half million liters of seawater at gso and four and a half million liters of fresh water three and a half million liters of seawater and about four and a half million liters of fresh water in the zoo on the site at any one time that has to be kept crystal clear like, like that, that mate yeah yeah now yeah. downstairs these are not little filters folks that you have on your on your pool or anything like that mum and dad have to put a bit of chemicals in to keep it all clean if you have a swim this is massive isn't it yeah, mate? the size of your car filters can we have a look huge let's go come and have a look at this this is so interesting so here we are this is underneath right directly underneath seal theater yeah, mate it certainly is can we have yeah. a look around yeah, this is sure. pretty incredible folks i'm getting a bit of a lay of the land here that area there that's the pool so that's, that's the pool, the pool. Which is where we were? The pool that we were just standing in front of, that's the wall of right it there. right there. Yep. Okay, I've got gotcha. you. And right here is the seating. That's where you sit Look at watch that. the seal show. Look up here, you can see the angle of how the seal theatre goes down. So we're right directly underneath it, yeah, folks. Yeah. Now, what are these, mate? These are our, these are our glass filters that filter the water that you just saw. Each filter weighs eight tonne, and there's nine pellets of sand or glass in each filter. So it's like a sand filter, but it's just like special glass that's particularly for these filters. Yeah, there's, there's, there's layers of glass in these filters, so it goes from uh, really fine to yeah. really coarse. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, better filtering and easier backwashing. Right, fantastic. Yeah. And four of these... They're the size goodness. of your car. My goodness, have yeah. a look at that, folks. That's incredible. That is definitely makes your pool filter at home look like... Uh, a little miniature little one, miniature that's for one, sure. Yeah, yeah. And this, yep. all this pipe work here pushes all the water around to all the different pools. Yeah, we go into the filter, we go back into the pool. So, yeah, that's how it works. What are these? Now, what we have there is uh, actuator valves. So, we don't actually have to do any manual backwashing anymore. What we do is it's on the computer. Every 72 hours or 48 hours, it automatically backwashes itself. So, it's kind of doing us out of a job. But um, it means we get consistent backwashing. What's next? What's, let's go. <laughs> this is incredible, folks. So this is really like the engine room, one of the engine rooms of the zoo and how it works, all the work that goes into this. What time do you start, mate? Six. Yeah, six o'clock in the morning. This is all happening while you're asleep, unless you get up really early yeah, as well. Yeah. There's loads that happens at the zoo before the zoo opens. And it's the water tech team that look after this amazing, amazing equipment. What's this so, one? So that's our contact tank for our ozone. So, so all our swimming pools are run on ozone. We don't pump ozone back into the pool, but we just put it through there, ozonate the water, and put fresh water back into the pool. So for people that don't understand maybe what ozone is and how that does, can you give a real sort of layman's explanation of that? Real, ozone's a really good oxidizer, so it basically kills all the bugs and basically pumps fresh water back into the swimming pool. Okay, so it goes through that, goes gets through cleaned that, up. Cleaned up, and then back, back up in. for them. After right. it goes through our buildings. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Above our heads, it's like something out of Mission Impossible, folks. Seriously, there's pipe work going all over the top here. You can hear pumps Everywhere. going down here. It's getting noisier. Here. It's, it's getting, getting a bit noisier. noisier down here, so we might have to shout. I do yeah. apologise. So Hayden, what we've got here is our control panel. This reads all our ozone levels, our ORP, our pHs. This gets checked twice a day, calibrated every day. So this is pretty important. It's incredible the amount of stuff down here. I'm blown away. I've come down here a few times before and I found it really interesting and that's why I wanted to bring you down here because Troy and the team, Daryl, Sergey and, and, and Tommy, they're, they're specialists in their field. It's not just something that happens like you just come in and twiddle a few dials. These guys are specialists in their field and keep all the water in the zoo absolutely tip-top quality. It's yeah. amazing stuff. Yeah, it's great. Hey. Pretty loud here. Yeah, it's really loud. So so this... these, these are all our pumps that circulate our water through um, uh, the, the show pool and, and the hub. Habitat habitat pool. Pool. Yeah, right. yeah. So this is constantly, constantly moving. 24 hours a day, it doesn't stop. 
It doesn't even stop the backwash. Now yeah, it's dealing with salt water, so there must be a lot of wear and tear on this. Yeah, they're, they're, they're usually pulled out 12 months, swapped over, or serviced. Right. Yeah, yeah. Salt water is really, really hard on Harsh metal water. and things, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, now, yeah. we can go further. Can, can we have a look down further? Let's go further down. You can go deeper yeah. into the zoo. There's more of this. Come on, let's Good go. Fun. So this is another level down, Troy, yeah. up from Seal Theatre, below Seal Theatre, and we've come down to another plant room. How many plant rooms are there in the zoo? There's five seawater plant rooms and one major freshwater plant room right. up, upstairs a bit more. Give us a look around here. This is incredible. It's just like the amount of equipment in here, folks, is absolutely amazing. So, hey, this is our pump set up. So we've got silk coat pumps, penguin pumps, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. So constantly pumping constantly water. Constantly pumping, turning over our water. It's through the filtration system. Yep. And let me recap, I've got to get this right, because folks, this is not just like water out of your pool running through a filter. There's a lot of tech in here, isn't there? The water gets pumped through the filters. Goes through the filter, through the ozone, Okay. through the protein skimmers, back into the pool. So the protein skimmers, they take out they take out the fats and, and body oils from the animals. Right, and, and, and a bit of waste. Yeah, a bit of waste as well. Right, yeah, okay. Yeah. So they're, really, they're really critical. It's incredible, mate. It yeah, really is. So everywhere I look, there's gauges, dials, serious bits of technology. Yeah, plenty of tech in here. And how do you sort of look at it all at one spot? We have a screen. <laughs> a screen. Let's go. Okay, give us a look. All right, the main menu. The main menu. The thing... I sort of, I walk straight past folks, the main menu. Yes. <laughs> Look at that, it's got our little logo on it yeah, and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell so us about this. This. This, is our, this is a serious bit of tech which we've got for all the plant rooms. So in every plant room, there's one of these screens. And in every plant room, we can have a look at other plant rooms. So we don't have to be in the plant room. So you can run another plant room from this from screen? From here, yeah. Oh yeah. my goodness. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I can, I can go, we're in Lower Penguin at the moment. Yeah. I can go to Seal Bay and see what's happening in Seal Bay without even going there. Gotta put my specs on, folks. Okay, so that's all the that's all our filtration in Pumps, Seal Bay. Tells us, yep. Seal There's a the little pool. seal. There's a little seal. So that's one of our plant rooms. This tells us if, if our ozone's working, which it is, it's all green. So that's basically our system. Oh, also we can tell if what's going on with elephants. Tapirs. Tells us what's going on there. Fisher cats. So we can look. We can be in one place and look at everything. That's quite incredible. Yeah, so yeah, if you is. just did a bit of work over in another plant room, you had to come down here and do something. You could just check to see if that was all operating well in the other plant room. Yeah, that's basically. fantastic. Because yep, yep. the zoo is built on a hill like this, folks. I tell you what, there's a lot of walking up and down, which is really good for you, but it does take a lot of your time a day travelling into one place to the yeah. other. So let me just have a look through here. Elephant. Tapia, which is now yeah, pig, pygmy hippo, yeah. hippopotamus. Yep. Otters, fishing cats, wetland, misting system, ozone generator. That's all the fresh water. That's right. Correct? Yep. yep. And then we've got, where's all the, all the seawater? So this is all our seawater right here. All oh, right. Yeah. So Seal Bay, Lower Penguin, Performance, performance Habitat, sure. Seal Cove. Wow, sea wow, wow. Penguins, pelicans. Pelican yeah. pools. Yeah. It's incredible, Amazing. folks. Amazing. Just to... I really wanted to bring you down here. Thanks, Troy. Look, it's, it's so interesting to see that this sort of stuff happens underneath the zoo whilst you're asleep. That's the interesting thing, and I think there's a, that's what Taronga TV is all about, bringing you into these amazing places to meet amazing water tech team that do this work before the zoo even opens. These guys are here five or six o'clock in the morning. We're just getting up making our first coffee. The zoo has probably moved hundreds of thousands of litres of water through filtration systems for all the animals in our care. Yep. Troy, thanks mate. Thank you. Hey. I really, Cheers. really enjoyed this. And for anyone that loves a bit of tech, I just thought this would be a super cool one. You yep. never know what's around the next corner on Taronga TV. We'll see you next time. Thanks mate.